Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So we are going to talk about another React error which is going to be similar to the previous one that we talked about. And in this one, what we are going to do and work around is arrays. So the last one was regarding strings. So this one is regarding maps, basically. So an array of data will be handled. Uh, so let's get into it. So the error that you can see on my screen says that cannot read properties of undefined reading map. So you must have worked around ma with maps in your codes and uh, you must be aware that it works on key value pair, right? Uh, but that was not the case that we're going to handle in this one. What it is telling me is that uh, basically a property that it tried to read basically came as undefined and now it is having troubles with it. Now, with problem, now the problem with these types of errors is that they do not tell you the line of code that you're supposed to refer, right? So you have to get into the code, look where the map is. Now, the biggest hint here is it is trying to read a map, right? So I will look into the code, go to the maps that I've used and accordingly make the uh, fixing that is supposed to be done, right? So let's get into the code. So... If you have seen my previous video, uh, in that as well, I use the same code. I have just done a bit of uh, modifications here and there. So um, I have a child component over here that is basically, uh, you know, uh, using a map here. And in that map, there is an item and item.ids uh, and uh, item.name is getting access from it. But as such, uh, this data is undefined. It is not there, which is why the error is coming, right? So what the problem is that for the code, I am making it mandatory to read this uh, property, right? So, uh, and that is why it is throwing an error. So because it is mandatory, because it is a compulsion for the code to have that data in hand and it is not getting it, hence the error is coming, right? So for this, uh, to be handled, I am going to give it a simple solution, a very simple solution. I'm just going to give it uh, a condition that no worries, there can also be situations where, you know, there can be no data. An empty array can be also considered into this um, uh, situation, right? So based on the code that you are dealing with, right of course i'm not going to be using your code i am using a sample code in this case but in case you are, are uh, you know um, uh, are troubled with uh, with an error like this you can give your variable where you are accessing it a simple condition that yes there can be situations where there is a possibility of empty array or an empty string in the case of string as far as my last video is concerned but for this one as we are dealing with arrays and maps uh, hence i'm going to give it a second uh, situation where there is a possibility that it can be an empty array as well hence when i will save it my error will be gone right so as you can see my ui loaded and I am having uh, no troubles anymore. So I hope this works for you. And uh, let me know into the comment section if this worked for you. And I'll be really thankful if you give it a like and subscribe to my channel because I'm going to keep bringing such fun videos, short and quick solutions for you. Uh, and uh, it will also enhance my knowledge along with yours. So uh, let's get into it and uh, we'll meet you soon. Bye bye.